Hi, this is Mary with websites.ca. I'll go over how to edit a page in the Divi theme. All right, so I'm already logged into my website. If you have any issues logging into your website, just go to support.websites.ca or shoot us an email at support at websites.ca. We'll be able to help you out with that. All right, so just to check the theme on my website, I can hover over appearance and I can see that it says Divi theme options. So that's the theme options, but the important part is, is that we see that it's the Divi theme. So that's all right. We know what sort of uh, page we're going to be editing. So we'll just click on pages and I'll click on example page. This is the page I want to edit. So in here you can see that there are a few different modules if you scroll down. So there's slider, text, uh, a few blurbs and a call to action. You can move these modules around uh, which will change layout on the page of your site of where things go such as the slider and the text. Uh, but please be very careful when moving these around. As with anything with editing your website, if you have any questions or you're unsure about anything, just give us a call or email us. Um, you know, it's very important that you don't lose any information on your site. It might not be able to be retrieved. Um, we don't want your site to get broken in any way. So if you're unsure, you can always send us the updates that's included in your package at no extra cost. So you don't need to worry about, um, you know, if you uh, run into any issues. Always, you can always hand those over to us. All right, so we'll have a look at the uh, text section. So we'll just click the three lines on there and that'll bring up how to uh, edit a certain section of text. So we can see here that uh, we have the options to, uh, just like in any editor, to add additional text. Um, and we can uh, always just hit save. That's the blue button in the bottom right hand corner. Um, that will save your work. All right, so if you save something and uh, you realize that you don't want it on the page, you can always just navigate away from the page in any way, including when you move things around. Um, that won't automatically save to the website, but if you do want to save your changes, just click on update, that blue button on the uh, right hand side of the page there. So that'll uh, take you to the updated page. We can just click on view page to see it. And so we can see the uh, slider that we've updated, and we can also scroll down and see where we added the text here as well. Alright, so like I said, if you have any issues or run into any problems editing your website, don't hesitate to uh, contact us at support.websites.ca or by emailing us at support at websites.ca to help you out with that. And like I said, all updates are included in your package as well. Thanks again, and this has been Merrick for websites.ca.